Okay, I'm going to guide you through the finger pulse oximeter kit, what it is and how to use it. It's a u useful diagnostic tool to determine if an individual has sleep apnea. Sleep apnea is a medical condition whereby an individual doesn't get enough oxygen uh, within their system over the course of a night. Now that might be because the central nervous system isn't giving the right signals uh, to breathe properly or perhaps there might be an obstruction. Uh, the airways might collapse when your body relaxes when you sleep. Uh, and quite often in this latter case individuals uh, snore and usually quite loudly. Uh, despite this obvious outward symptom uh, a lot of people don't get diagnosed. Roughly 80% of people with apnea uh, are never diagnosed with it. Uh, and this piece of kit will give you a good indication of whether you have it or not. Right, so here are the contents of the kit. We have the oximeter itself, which will is small enough to fit neatly on your finger overnight. It'll record your oxygen levels and pulse rate throughout the course of the night. That's stored on the little device. You need to upload that data to your PC and this DVD contains a software which will interpret that data. There's an instruction manual and then to charge the actual device itself there's a mini USB uh, charging device there. So when it's fully charged, the light on the plug itself should turn green. Uh, right, so I've popped the finger pulse oximeter onto my finger and switch it on by pressing the white button. These are the immediate readings. Uh, so the reading on the left is the percent oxygen saturation. Uh, anything in the high 90s is reasonable. Uh, and the smaller value on the right is my pulse rate. Um, I would make one caveat with this, which is that the pulse rate readings seem to be perturbed by movement, whereas the oxygen levels don't. So just to demonstrate with my finger, and you can see the signal uh, on the bottom half of the screen, which is my pulse rate, moves uh, quite erratically when I perturb it, and I can show you that's not actually what my heart is doing at that time. So, right. Let's set it to record uh, my pulse rate and oxygen levels, which I would like to do just before I go to bed. Uh, to get to the menu, you press and hold the white button, navigate down to record by pressing the white button, press and hold once you reach record. You can input the current time if you like, you can do that just pressing and holding and increment the values. It's about 10 o'clock now. This won't affect the readings, but it will help you keep track of uh, your readings throughout the night. So, there we go. Press and hold yes. Right, record says it's on. Down, we won't bother about the wireless settings. And exit. Right, it's now recording. You can see that with the flashing light. Don't worry if you pull it off in the night. Uh, just put it back on again. And it will continue recording so long as it's switched on you can switch it back on it will keep recording uh, once you're done you'll need to upload the data I'll show you how to do that in a moment